so to get started you got to open your procreate app and i have already selected a square canvas so i'm going to first draw a circle and place it in the center now let's add some lines to give it the hot air balloon look I'm going to fill up some bright colors. You can choose any color of your choice. Now from that arrow icon, tap on that arrow icon and select the wrap feature. And then I'm going to stretch it down and give it a hot air balloon shape. Now opening a new layer and making the basket. colors and now I guess the straight lines appear to be more okay so we are going to go with the straight lines as its holders and my hot air balloon is done now I'm just going to add a tag of adventure here color arranging it in the center again choosing the text add text I'm going to write adventure choose any font you like giving it the black color now again with the wrap feature align it in the curves of the banner merging it all down This is a hot air balloon and we are now going to convert it into a GIF. I am shrinking the size and I am going to duplicate it. Three fingers swipe down to duplicate. From action menu, go to canvas and switch on the animation assist. From its settings, I'm going to choose loop. And uh, adjust the frames per second as per your need. And here we go. Our custom made GIF is all ready. Now I'm going to share it as an animated GIF without background through mail. I'm going to mail it to myself so that it is avail available to me on all my other devices. Now to place it on your story for Android users. Once you have received it in your gallery, go to your settings. 
and switch to G Box keyboard. G Box is available on Play Store. Once done, go to your Instagram stories, place any picture or photo you like. Once your G Box is set up, from that keyboard you will find a gallery icon. Go to the a gallery icon and you will find all your gallery items including the GIF. You can place it there and your story is done. For iPhone users, you can directly copy paste the GIF from your gallery to your story. Select the share, copy photo and then go back to your Instagram story and simply paste it and you are done. Thank you for watching and I hope you loved it. Don't forget to subscribe me and support me. Thank you.